Thanks for joining us at six tonight. Two communities are mourning the loss of a star basketball player. The Natomas Unified School District says that Anthony Williams died Saturday. Rockland police say that he was hit by a car and killed. Today, a growing memorial is near the crash site. Williams was a senior at Indercom High School, and before that, he was a student at Whitney High School in the Rockland School District. And tonight, we are hearing from Williams' friends and teachers who are just devastated by his loss. KCRE 3's Lise Mitri spoke to them in Rockland. I don't really remember a time when I saw Anthony without a smile on his face. A big smile remembered fondly by those who knew Anthony Williams. <laughs> the 18 year old Intercom High School basketball player was 6'8", but when people describe him as being larger than life, they're usually talking about his personality. He was always laughing and always having a good time. 16 year old Sienna Cotta left flowers for him at a memorial off Lone Tree Boulevard near Adams Drive in Rockland. The scene of the deadly crash Saturday night. Rockland police say a driver who showed no signs of impairment hit and killed a man who was walking in the road. So, yeah. Late last night, Jeff Darrow learned that man was his former middle school student. It was him. And I saw a picture of him in his, in his uniform, smiling. And it, it, was, it was Anthony. Before playing basketball at Intercom High, he played at Whitney High School in Rockland and outside of school with the Youth Basketball Academy. A coach there says he even became William's foster parent, letting him move in. He had a lot of people on the side, like a lot of people wanted to see him succeed. Darrow remembered the time in middle school when Williams challenged him to play one on one. Darrow figured Williams would destroy him. So I kept making up these excuses like, sorry, bud, like, you know, I pulled my hamstring or I left my shoes at home. And uh, he just was a, just a funny kid and he would laugh about it and he had the best smile. And they lost touch over the years, but the memory stuck with Darrow. Like, I just kind of regret that I like never, but we joked about it, like he was going to play me in basketball, but I, I never played that, that, that game with him, like that one on one game. In Rockland, Liz Amy Tree, KCRA 3 News. Both Natomas and Rockland Unified School Districts had grief counselors and chaplains on hand today for students and staff who needed support during this difficult time.